Today I'm back in South London at this incredible family home. It's five bedrooms, it's got a really cool basement. Let's go check it out. So as you enter the property, on the right hand side you've got a sitting area which is super relaxing, calming and it's really inviting. The grey sofas that meet each other, really chill. So what instantly jumps out at you is just how big this island is. It goes the whole length of the kitchen. The other thing about this kitchen is the storage is nuts. I mean just have a look, you've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, it's about 16 cupboards here and you've got all underneath here. I mean I know this channel is not about storage, it's about beautiful spaces but it's just something that I had to highlight. As you move down to this side, the bifold doors are an amazing feature. Just have a look at these, they open up on both corners. So the owner has told us that he uses a lot of steel to do this but it means that the corner of the doors, there is nothing there. They literally have opened up outwards. Over here, they've got this really inviting sofa. I mean, just have a look at that. Gonna check it out. Oh, super comfy. And look at that, I love the way that the TV is just tucked away into this almost cupboard. I mean, it just means that the space doesn't feel like it's got a TV, but actually there's one right there. And over here is a dining space. Oh, look at that. The sun is just beamed straight onto the table. Hope we got that. And then you've got another sort of tranquil sitting area with these really comfortable big leather seats. Just super chill. Let's move on. And the bifold doors open up into the garden, which as you can see has three levels. These stairs here lead to this awesome basement that they've got. So before I show you upstairs, let's go check out the basement. This is super cool how they've got these stones around the banister. So as you come downstairs, the first thing that hits you is this fish tank, which is the first for the channel. We haven't seen a fish tank yet, but yeah, it's set in the wall and you can see through on both sides, which is awesome. So down here, they've actually called this a snug chill room, den, whatever you want to call it. But they've got this cool wraparound sofa, TV, just for chilling out and relaxing. Love it. Right, let's head upstairs. So there's a bathroom here, first bedroom there. This is the guest bedroom, which I'll show you. It's got a really cool loaf yellow bed frame with views out onto the garden. So as you come out of the guest bedroom and walk down the hallway, you enter into the beautifully designed master bedroom. Just look at this space. You've got a pink headboard that runs along the wall, loads of wardrobe space over there. But if you come over here, you have the ensuite. Which you've got a bath on the left. And then over on this side of the room, you've got a big shower with a rainfall shower head. Also love the detailing of this sort of mosaic splashback. Right, let's head up to the third floor. So, you have another bedroom here, another bedroom here, and a bathroom in here. But they've got this really cool space up here that isn't actually being utilized at the moment. But they've designed this spiral staircase which goes up. So this is a loft room. It's really cool. You've got the two skylights either side. Just a really cool design space. So that's it for another property in South London. They actually booked this place out a lot for film and photo shoots, so check the link in the description. If you like my content, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.